so this is a six mark uh, question and let me put an r here just to indicate that it is an uh, repeated question so what is it an angle in a semicircle is a right angle i have to prove by a uh, vector method so so for that first let's see how a semicircle looks like so i'm going to draw a semicircle here and i should prove that an angle in a semicircle is a right angle so if it is a circle obviously there'll be a center o here and let me mark the diameter as a and b now i'm going to choose any point any point on the circle right right now let me connect op oa and ob pb right so if i have to prove an angle in a semicircle is a right angle it obviously means this angle right so i have to prove that this angle here angle a p b is equal to 90 degrees so this is what i have to prove to prove that angle a p b is 90 degrees now quickly what can you see here are you able to see it's two triangles right a p and o so and uh, you have two triangles right so let me light the two triangles that you see here so one triangle is a p o so p o vector is one o a vector is one and then these two are joined by p a likewise p o vector and o b vector and these two are joined by the p b vector so now we have two triangles and since this is also a circle semi circle obviously the radius will be the same right so can i say that o a is equal to o b is equal to o p because of radius right now you know that if you have to prove that the angle is 90 degrees you have to prove that p a vector dot p b vector is equal to 0 this we already know right if the scalar product of two vectors is 0 then it means that the two sides form 90 degrees with each other so to prove that p a vector dot p b vector is equal to 0 how can i write p a vector p a vector can be written as it's nothing but p o vector right plus o a vector right p a plus o a vector likewise p b vector is nothing but p o vector plus o b vector right but can i write o b as negative of o a right because the direction is opposite right so i can say p o vector minus o a vector why am i doing this because when i do the dot product of p a and p b vector i want the elements to be the same so now it will be p o vector plus o a vector dot p o vector negative o a vector right so what happens when you do a dot product of this it is p o vector squared minus o a vector squared so since this is nothing but the radius right p o o a we know that they are all the same right because it's a radius so since it's the same this will be zero right so you have proved that p a vector dot p b vector is zero so if they are zero it obviously means that p a vector is perpendicular to p b vector that is the angle between them is 90 degrees so this proves that angle what is the angle we said a p b is equal to 90 degrees okay